Welcome to the Thargoid Report. I'm Commander Burr. If you find this information useful then consider subscribing to the channel and remember to turn on notifications to make sure you see all our future videos. After the sudden and surprise attacks last week left 6 stations ablaze the galactic community leapt into action and the incursions were cleared in around 50 hours. That's a magnificent effort but it seems the bugs are not done with us yet. In case you're new to the game here's a quick and dirty overview of how things with the Thargoids generally go. The Eagle Eye sensor network usually starts providing intel on what systems have been targeted by the Thargoids on Thursdays. Rather conveniently the aggressive alien menace is quite regular and predictable with their war efforts. The targeted systems are then in a state of infestation and will be awash with non-human signal sources full of Thargoids of varying strengths, most of them hyper aggressive scout class craft. If enough of these signal sources can be cleared of Thargoids then the system will remain safe. If not then the following Thursday the system will enter a state of incursion and human held space stations in the system can be left burning in space with the civilian population desperate to be evacuated. The system will also be populated with non-human signal sources full of larger Thargoid interceptor class vessels. Until enough of the Thargoid threat has been removed from the system it will remain in this state week after week. That's how a normal week unfolds. This has not been a normal week however. The attacks last week had no infestation state before them and initially the Eagle Eye network wasn't reporting any infestations. That changed however midway through the week and with not enough time to make a significant dent in the infestations that were being reported there were significant and legitimate concerns that all of the 6 targeted systems would fall to the Thargoid advance this week. However when the Thargoid tick happened on Thursday there were no new incursion states. It's possible the Goids may be waiting for everyone to be back on an even keel following this weeks patch which is very decent of them. Whatever the reason we have a small reprieve this week. There are now new infestations being reported but there are no new incursions or burning stations. So with all that said here's what you can do right now to get involved. The Eagle Eye sensor network is reporting Thargoid infestations in the following systems. Taygeta Electra, Pleiades Sector DLY D65, HR1183 and HIP1185 and Wellington. The scout class vessels are easily destroyed by the base level AX weaponry that requires no unlocking. They also count as elite ranked ships and so this is an excellent way to level up your combat rank. Be sure to have access to decontamination limpets however as they do deal significant caustic damage when they pop. If you are going up against Thargoids it's always advisable to go with support and you'll find a link to the discord for the Anti Xeno Initiative a huge community dedicated entirely to tackling the Thargoid threat in the description below. As well as tackling Thargoids head on the AXI will provide guidance and tutorials on how to tackle Goids and what kit you'll need to bring to the fight. There is no higher authority. Wherever you go commanders remember pick your fights with care. As I've mentioned there are no new incursions and no stations on fire. To better be prepared for that future eventuality however you can join the discord for the post disaster evacuation service. The PDES is an entire community dedicated to running evacuation and search and rescue operations from the burning stations. They'll help you wing up with other commanders on the same mission and help keep community relief efforts focused. And finally Operation Ida continue to run freight to stations previously knocked out by Thargoid incursion. Those guys will always find a use for your cargo hold and their discord server is also linked below. All the targets I've listed this week have been placed in priority order with the assistance of the guys at the AXI. To get the latest updated information on the Thargoid advance you can also check out the reddit post maintained by Commander Mgram of the AXI which again is linked below. 
Thanks for watching. If you found this video useful consider subscribing to the channel and remember to turn on notifications to make sure you see all our future content. That's it for now. We'll be back later this week with more videos. Until then ….o7 CMDRs may all your high predictions be brief and don't let the laser lettuce give you nightmares. We very much look forward to seeing you next time. Thank you.